Hello everyone, I'm Steve. Mark's around. Say hi, Mark. And this is Smokey Steve and Mark. Welcome or welcome back. And here we are with another Steve. We'll try it. And I have to say, holiday, celebrate. Ooh. This I wanted to show off. This was from Dope. Have a dope day. This came in. This was a gift from a viewer. And we were waiting to try it out. I'm covered in glitter. It's just like old times. So, so welcome to a celebratory Steve will try it. Hope everyone's doing good. Hope everyone's safe, feeling all right. It's a little bit of a party time around here. Celebrate what? Well, I have some cake toppers that we're gonna try out today. Now, not one, not two, but about six, almost. So, you know Mark Bakes, he's a chef, and it's more than just the icing when you're presenting a cake to someone. Sometimes it's that little bit of extra, whether you see someone putting a hundred candles on a cake for a senior, um, ones that explode in your face, or that can set the ceiling on fire, all different kinds. So we have some today that we're gonna take a look at and um, give them a whirl, see what floats, what sinks, and next time you have a reason to decorate a cake, maybe you'll have an idea of something that could help. So we'll start at the very basic of basics. How cute is this little candle up? Okay, so this is gonna just sit on the cake. And of course, if it doesn't come with candles, you have to get candles, which might be in the freezer section of your grocery store if you can't find them. Sometimes they put them by the other cakes. Next, quick light birthday candles. These all have a few directions, but this one, the gist is that you set all the candles up like normal, but they're linked with a paper tie next to each other, kind of like a chain. So when you light one, it should light the next, the next, the next. We shall see. So we have that. This one, you'll be happy to know, Party Popper Cake Topper is glitter. Absolute patent pending technology is the first Party Popper made just for a cake. Edible glitter will come out of this and for anyone concerned it is only one net carb. So we're gonna try this out too. It's supposed to decorate your cake with edible gold. So we'll, we'll see, we'll see. Then I have a few that are a little more, a little more out there. So these are definitely officially cake toppers. And these require a little bit of assembly. Oh my god. So, spin credible candle. So this has just four pieces to set up. We're gonna put the base with the extra candles and a lid on it on right top and it's gonna spin. It's gonna be cute. So we'll give that a whirl. We don't have six cakes. We have a little bit fewer than that. Glitter incredible candle. Um, what you've also probably seen if you watch bloopers fails and whatnot with kids and birthdays the candles that open up. So this is one where we're gonna be able to light it in the center and it's supposed to open up for us and light up into all the candles. I believe it's 16. There's that, and then the incredible candle. They're all very close, aren't they? Again, another one. This will come with some instructions we'll go through where you light one, it lights the others, and then it decorates the whole thing. So I'm pretty excited about this. Now Mark, of course, is never too far. Mark did help us put together a cake for the occasion. And what we're gonna do is take them into the that part of the studio, lay them all out, we'll get the cake, I'll get some um, safety things, cause you know, if we're playing with fire, keep the extinguisher nearby. And uh, we'll give them a whirl and see what floats and what sinks. All right, so y'all ready to get celebratory? Then let's celebrate. you shall receive we have cake so what i have on top here is the first one that one of the first ones i showed you the cake candelabra so this package comes with a little candelabra and one two three four five six seven and candles too so it comes with the white ones if this wasn't fussy stick it in it comes in make a wish flattens out like that so that will come out so that's not bad it's cute it's nothing you know like over the top but it's it's okay Old Faithful, we'll call it. And the brand name is Fred. How about that? So, next we're going to give it a whirl with the Spring Credible. It's Spring Credible. Okay, so this is another cake topper that we have. And these aren't just fun for kids. I would love a cake topper, too. So, we're going to go with the directions on this. This is the base. 
for Arcade Tower. There's a button here. This is going to play music at some point, I believe. So we're just going to go with the directions. There's that. And it comes with little, little, little candles. So you're not going to be able to swap these out of the box um, for some store brand. You're going to actually have to have the little ones they recommend, which are little, 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 like perspective wise. They're very little. But these are the ones that go into this guy. All right, we're getting into this. So we have the base we put on. These are the little candles. This is the stem of it. This will be the top of it. And it says, happy birthday. And we have some little charms that come with it that get put on top of that, which are very cute. I mean, I grew up with homemade birthday cakes for like every birthday. My mom did one one year that was like Mario and Luigi. Um, and it looked like one of the castles at the end of Mario Brothers 1. It was so cute. So we always had more handmade, less less fancy decorated. I don't know. More hand. Home done. So I can put a few charms on this and then there's the little topper. And now in theory, I should be able to light these candles and this should spin. And we hope nothing gets torched, right? Okay. It's lit, it's spinning, it's supposed to sing a song. Now, is that cute or is that cute? Dear me, happy birthday to me. This reminds me of another couple devices we had that would take tea lights and that they would spin. It's gonna keep going until I shut it off, so. I approve, this one was good. I might, if it wasn't doing it for this, assemble it off and then put it on top at the end, just for squishiness sake. So, all right, let's give it another one. Okay, up next we have the Quick Light Birthday Candles. So what's the kitsch? It looks like a box of birthday candles, and it is the special effect of these. Okay, let me get them out here to show you. They're strung together with paper. Think wick, you know, think like, um, it's gonna catch, one's gonna go to the next, go to the next, and then they're all gonna light. So I'm gonna work these in here. We'll light it together and we'll see where it goes. So first things first, do not let, if you can help it, the paper drip, like dry out between. You wanna have them tight all the way around. So I'll bring you back and see if we know how I, if I know how to do it. All right, so now these quick light aren't going as easily as I would have liked. You can get a few different reams of them. It does say that on the package because this is how far we got. We're just halfway around here. So for effect, for going forward, anything bigger than a cupcake, get a few of these. But we're gonna light it and in theory, they should catch all the way across. So we'll see. I approve. That was great. Keep the kids back. It's gonna smell like it's burning. Don't be scared, because I thought it was gonna burn slower than that. But here, we got, a, we got a whole cake full of things. I think you'd probably need to, like I said, to cover it, unless you've got someone under the age of 10 gonna have a birthday. But that is our quick light candles. Hmm. What's up next? Incredible candle. So the incredible candle, the original, was supposed to open, spin, and play happy birthday. So we'll, we'll see what's good. Like. We have the first one. There's actually two or three that we've picked out that are supposed to sing to us. So I'm going to get it out of the box. We'll get it up on the cake. And we'll see what's, what's what with this. I'm optimistic. I've seen similar. So, okay. So cake topper, it has topped the cake. So it's halfway there. Now let's look at our little bit of the directions over here. Flaming sparkles will shoot from the center of the candle, slowly lighting the 14 candles below it. Okay, so I'm gonna light this in here. It's gonna light these other little candles and it should all fall out, okay? St. Anthony. We have renter's insurance, right? Okay. You ready? Because I'm ready. is precious. I can't believe that worked. I had low expectations, guys. This is pretty cool. Now what it says to do if you want to stop the music is to cut the wire cord, which is underneath here. We'll let these go. I get another birthday candle that I get to blow out. And then I think after this one, we're going to head into the kitchen, a little change of scenery, and I have a couple more that I want to show you too. 
Make another wish. So we're gonna try out our last two cake toppers. This one is a straight up party popper. It's edible confetti included. You know, we have a soft spot for confetti on this channel. So the directions say to take one of these out. We'll go with silver. And this is the device. This is how it's going to go into the cake. Okay. This is a, a wick. Like you're gonna be lighting a, a stick of dynamite. And it comes with glitter. And we're gonna pour half of this into the top of that as best you can. Edible glitter too, so don't be, don't be scared, it's okay. All right, that's about half. And now, with the help of a cameraman, let's see what happens. That was so cute, look at that. It's like perfectly even too. Oh wow, I had lower expectations for that. That is so cool! All right, we have one last one. Let me get this boy set up and we will see what to see. This is awesome. Right, and now we have our last one, our incredible candle. The setup of this is similar to the other. I'm gonna light a wick in the center that's gonna spill down and allegedly light about 16 candles. They do include a stick to use. If you have stick matches, go ahead and do that. Um, Probably better. And it's a very, very, very small fuse, but it's, you'll know, like that. Isn't that some stuff? I think that's great. And it sings. So I have thoughts mostly good a few, maybe not so friendly, but um, we had five celebrations. I just had five birthdays, I'm thrilled. So we're gonna take ourselves back over to the couch. We're gonna review the five or six that we did and I'll let you know my top pick, okay? Well, here we are back on the couch. And by the way, before I go a moment further, cake, chocolate, butterscotch, marshmallow, cake. Stay on with Mark. It'll be coming up soon. Trust me. So now let me just give you a little bit of a, a thought here on one to five, five thumbs up, one thumbs up, which was good. So we had five or six products going. Now, none of these bombed. Everything that we used actually worked the way it was pretty much supposed to. Uh, it's whether it was glittery, it's whether it played music, um, there was a few different things we were rigging them out of. So we'll start on the lower ones that we did, and the lower ones only got uh, three out of five. Like I said, nothing was terrible, but some of them were just average. So the cake candelabra, which we started with, very simple, very easy, not a lot of bells and whistles, don't need a fire extinguisher, comes with the candles, you just plug it in, put it on your cake, it's pretty cute. Three out of five, it's cute. The quick light birthday candles, these are the ones that when you put on the cake, they were all chained together with paper, and you light one like a wig and it lit them all at once, and that one actually worked too. Um, but beyond that, it's, it's a little flashy, and then there's some candles. So again, we're going to give it like a three. Three out of five. Going forward. Which one did I like next best? Okay, so we had a, the original incredible candle. These were the ones that opened up like this. Mark will drop you one down now, probably. And they did what they were supposed to do. You would light one wick, the whole thing blossomed open, and it played music. 
So I'm gonna say for those two, four out of five, I have to say. And what did I like about them? They lit, they played music, they were colorful, there was some movement to it. It wasn't like that unsafe feeling like on a bloopers video where the whole house goes up in flames from the candles, so. And who got the best place? Five out of five? Da, 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 da. On top of Mark's cake. Why? It's reusable. All of these things were very, very cool. But you can't use most of them twice. Candles burn out, the thing opens up, you throw it out, the wick burns. Um, this one, actually, you can light the candles and it'll keep spinning. It's very, very cute. And you can use it one more time. So the idea that it was reusable was what pushed it over the edge as the winner for all of them. So that will be our five out of five. <laughs> Almost forgot one that was an honorable mention, too, coming in around fourth. The glitter bomb. Remember this one? We put the pack of glitter, put half of it in, stick this into the cake, light the wick, and it shoots it over the top and drops it onto the surface of the cake. That worked pretty well, too. Hands are good also. So it worked, but so we'll say four out of five. But again, that was our, our last one that missed it. The grand prize winner is the one we have here. The one that sings and spins and is glittery because that is what celebrations are all about. So thank you all for joining us and thank you all for watching. Please do subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell. You'll get alerts when we have new videos and go live. We're on Facebook, X, Instagram, all our contact infos below. Uh, thank you all very much, and we will catch up with you very soon. All right? Be sweet to yourself. Find a reason to celebrate today, and we'll talk to you soon. Say bye, Mark. Bye.